So our beloved Hop Devil turns 21 this year, and uh, you know that's sort of a coming of age. We thought it was time to um, take his look and give it a new style. Well, you know, we had a lot of open road when it came to designing and developing an image for a beer back in 1995, um, because uh, there's so many, so fewer craft breweries. One of the great books that I enjoyed at that time, this was published in 1991, was from the British beer author Michael Jackson. And uh, though it's the great beers of Belgium, one of the traditions that I found mind-blowing was he was talking about the hop devil, uh, this concept of a mythical beast that lived in the hop fields of Belgium. At least that's what farmers believed. So I had this in my head before we began sketching the hop devil, but of course I didn't want to do something completely derivative of something that existed. And this is sort of all the remains of some of the sketches. We've got uh, black and white sketches, the hop cone, some eyes forming, using luminosity to sort of maybe uh, suggest something fiendish, something devilish. And then it was at this point where I started to exchange my ideas with my buddy Tony, who's a fantastic illustrator uh, based in Brooklyn. He's worked on a number of logos with us over time. And going back and forth over facts, remember those days, um, rather than digital, Tony came up with this sketch, um, which was really the hop devil fully resolved. Um, there was a number of iterations from here to here, but uh, this really captured the roguish quality uh, that we were looking for this guy, someone who would have real personality and, uh, you know, a leafy party animal. My name is Luke Widener, and I am a senior graphic designer here at Victory. I was challenged with taking something that's been around for 21 years that people have loved, uh, Hop Devil, and uh, breathing new life into it, you know, making something new out of something that's loved by so many. Graphic design is a means of taking an idea or a concept or a feeling and visualizing it. In terms of beer labels, there's a lot of things that we need to take into account. We need to understand our audience. You know, who are these? Who are you people? Um, you know, uh, what's, who are we trying to reach? What's the tone? What's the flavor? I mean, we look at a lot of aspects before we even put pencil to paper. Um, and it can be a huge challenge sometimes. Uh, with Hop Devil specifically, this guy's been around for 21 years. There's people out there that have him tattooed on their bodies. So when I look at the original Hop Devil label, uh, one of the things that I really saw was it's the focus on the character. It's the focus on this Hop is a devil and really establishing him. But he's had 21 years to ingrain himself in craft beer culture and he's been quite successful at burrowing into everyone's hearts. So what I kind of wanted to do was explore what would those 21 years do to someone who was born in 1996? You know, how would the experiences in life weigh on you or, or change your appearance? We had a lot of debate here about earrings. You know, he's a little wiser, maybe he's a little jaded. He's got his ears pierced now. We changed his expression. He's got red eyes. They're much fuller eyes now. Eyes that I think kind of reflect his menacing qualities or maybe reflect a little more of his world experience. But ultimately what's great to do is when you take Hot Devil, new and old, and put them right next to each other. You might not notice, but when you put him next to the old one, you see he's completely different but the same. It's, it's, he's aged, he's wiser, he's smarter, but he's still delicious. So uh, that was my goal. And when you see Hop Devil on the shelf in its new form, my goal was that you see him, you recognize him right away. Hop Devil's just been so special to me because it was my introduction to craft beer and IPAs, which I absolutely love. Um, it's, it's, it's been great to see him evolve. Um, I'm honored to be part of his most recent evolution and I wish him a very happy birthday. <laughs>